Guys, welcome to my first ever food haul. Now this is somewhere we don't usually go all the time, but I thought I'd show you what we do get when we do shop at Tesco's. The bag is jam packed with goodness. Let's see what vegan treats we've got inside. Come in, let's have a look. So let's start, we've got a Moo Free Oscar the Bear. Never had this. But I can vouch for this company. We have <laughs> <laughs> That's how much food is in this bag. It's round. Right, actually, let me leave this on the floor. How not to do a food haul. Yeah, how Moo Free, Oscar the Bear. Never had this before, dairy free. But we've had so many items and goodies from this company, Moo Free. We usually order direct straight from them. They send out in about two or three days. They do minty moves, the bunny combs. The selection is just crazy. So this is for my daughter for Christmas, I believe. If I don't eat it before then, but we'll see. So move three. Box standards, got to get the bananas in. Now, I never actually eat bananas, ever. I usually eat them in a smoothie or I throw them in the porridge but you'll never see me eating a banana. Don't know why, I don't really like the texture. So, there we go. I never knew that. Did you not? I never eat them. Strawberries, perfectly imperfect. A bit like me, you know what I mean? <laughs> a bit rough on the edges and that, but perfect inside. <laughs> Strawberries. Right, next up, red lentil pasta, high in protein. Great source of carbs and also a good source of protein. Can't go wrong. Oh, so now we've got a lot from the range wicked. I do believe this is only sold in Tesco. So this would be tonight's dessert. Never had this before. Red velvet, brownie. I'm not a great fan of chocolate, cakes. So we're gonna try this, see how it goes down. Uh, before we have that, wow. The boxes have been destroyed. <laughs> We've got two pizzas here. Again, Wicked Kitchen by Tesco's. Exclusively for Tesco's. Lift them up. We've got the margarita saldo pizza. And it's like a pesto-y sauce. I can't stand pesto. But I've had this before and the pesto is banging. That's the first pizza. And then the second one, spicy mushroom and sourdough, so basically the same as this one, but it's got a spicy mushroom on it. This one is my favorite pizza so far. Definitely, definitely. Big up Wicked Kitchen. Nasty bird, mate. Oh, also, side dish. We got the vegan Wicked Mac and Cheese. Not sure what that's on top of there. Is that like crispy onions? Yeah. Um, it's also got a butternut squash in there as well. Now. I think we've had this before. You think that we I think we have had it before. You think we didn't like it. I can't remember. We've had some terrible mac and cheeses though, haven't we? Yeah. Like, tasteless. But they look so, so inviting. They look so, yeah, they, they look so Moorish and you taste it, it's just dead. Hopefully this lives up to the rest of the standard of the Wicked Pizzas and the rest of the range. There we go. Look at that. Wicked. You know who you can send a sponsor to. Come on. <laughs> right, so. Organic Tesco oats. Now, some people do say they don't care what oats they use, but over, it was during lockdown, wasn't it? We were using the normal Scottish, ones. Scottish dusty oats. Call them dusty, because by the end of the tub, it's just dust. And then we used these ones once, and we was making, is it flapjacks? Flapjack, yeah. And the taste difference with these ones was just crazy. There was just more bite to it, had a better texture. And since then, we've not looked back. They were like, what, 70p more? But yeah, yeah you get more for, your, more for your money. So Definitely organic worth oats, it. porridge, flapjacks, can't go wrong. Now, the rest of this stuff in here is literally just chocolate. I'm gonna come and zoom in on the bag first. 
Here we go, look. It's just full of goodies. We've got Tesco free from. Let's get this all out, let's see you guys can see. We've got Tesco free from. Um, we've got white chocolate and normal chocolate. Willow, my daughter, loves these. She calls them sweeties because she don't eat actual sweeties. These are, these are her sweeties. We've got some mood free white baking drops. We've not tried these ones before, but you said you're going to dip these in. Strawberries. Strawberries. That sounds banging. I'm definitely here for some strawberries dipped in chocolate. This is a new one for us. Right, I thought we got three of these. No, we only got two in the end. Two of the of Christmas these. ones. So these are the Santa ones. We haven't even had Halloween yet. Got to get them when you see them though, because they sell out. Yeah, that's true. Or you buy them too early and someone in the house eats them. Before, yeah, you. Yeah, me. <laughs> before it's Christmas. <laughs> I'll stick these over here so you can hide them. Uh, we've got loads more mood free stuff here. We've got the white chocolate ones. We've got bunny comb. This one and uh, Mickey Mood flavor, definitely my favorite. Yeah, bun bunny comb is brilliant, man. I don't, and the weird thing is, I don't like honeycomb. So we'll go to Zizi's and I get them to take the honeycomb off the dessert every time because I don't like it. But the way you move chocolate, hide it inside, perfect. And we've got some original, that's bunny comb, bunny comb. We've got a lot of bunny combs. Yeah, we've got some original ones. We've had original, right? Basically, what's confusing us is that they changed the packaging. So it does feel like it's a completely different brand altogether, but yeah, it's still free. It's still Moo free. Moo free, I'm guessing, because there's no Moo type dairy milk in it. And it, this is the best, I believe this is the best vegan chocolate I've tasted so far, hands down. So that is it guys. That is our mini Tesco vegan shopping haul. And as you can see, there aren't like meals for the entire week or lunches it's because we do our shopping in like a variety of different shops because when you're vegan you have to go to one shop to get one thing and another to get something else so this is the stuff we usually get from tesco's and in another video i can definitely show you where we get other stuff from so guys if you're still here make sure you like click share share with a friend who's vegan or is struggling to become vegan and doesn't know what to buy and I'll see you again soon. Peace.